to be painted over with Geovike T98 shielding paint. We have applied one coat of 3-in-1 primer to the wall and the ceiling, so we're ready to start painting. shield against the 50 Hz electrical fields that are radiated by the cables inside the walls. At one point, the shielding grounding tape should be connected to the earthing electrical system at one single point. Before you proceed with the second coat of shielding paint, we recommend that you apply one coat of shielding paint directly onto the grounding tape and once it, it has dried, you can then proceed with the second coat of shielding paint. This is to ensure that the tape remains properly fixed. the shielding paint. This is to minimize the possibility that a handyman, for example, accidentally disconnects the ground from our shielded room. You should of course paint over the grounding tape once finished with the grounding process with two coats of the paint used for the final coat in the room. In this case, I would paint it with two coats of white silicate 